Hi, Trevor here with Running Warehouse with this week's vlog. Let's see what's new. Well, first up for New Balance, we have the 876. This is a really nice neutral trail shoe. They offer a um, debris free uh, construction upper. Uh, again, keeping any of that unwanted debris out of there, especially on the trails, which is really nice. Uh, it uses lightning dry in the collar lining to provide optimum moisture management and with the lockdown liner on that upper really keeps that foot feeling secure. Um, the 876 also uses a versatile outsole design for the road or trail so it will definitely meet your needs if you're in those transitions or just kind of wanting something for maybe a trail and maybe a little road. It's really nice, the 876. Well, moving on to Columbia here, we have the Ravenous. This is a nice lightweight trail shoe for the neutral individual. It uses the gusset of tongue, so you get to say goodbye to that unwanted debris when you're on the trails, which is really nice. I know I've had too many sticks and twigs in my shoes, and it's really irritating. This comes in at 10.9 ounces, which is nice and lightweight. It has a nice breathable upper mesh. Again, that midfoot really feels secure in the, uh, in the upper here. Also, it has a really nice aggressive outsole uh, sticky traction for the trails and for road running. So this is also a great shoe you can use as a 50-50 or all road or even all trail if you like. So it's all our personal preference. Also too, the Ravenous comes in an Omnitech. And if you're unfamiliar with the Omnitech, it's very similar to Gore-Tex and providing that waterproof protection. Well, moving on to Nike, we have the Free Run. This replaces the Free 5.0. This is a nice neutral lightweight shoe. It has a nice breathable upper. It has a booty-like construction to really keep that midfoot nice and secure in the shoe. Uh, it has a nice responsive ride in the midfoot without having to sacrifice any cushioning in the heel thanks to using Phylite throughout that midsole. It has a nice a lot of flexibility as you can see there. Great for that toe off. Again, you can use the free run for uh, training purposes with tempo runs, intervals, track workouts. You can even use this as everyday running or racing. So you have the Nike free run. It's a really cool product that they've made. Well, also another really cool product from Nike is the Superfly cap. This is an awesome cap. It's really lightweight, really breathable. I'll put it on for you. As you can see here, it really fits snug and secure on my head. And the best feature is the bill. You can actually really bend this bill to your liking, uh, which is really great. I've always loved to be able to have hats I can really mold in there. The Superfly cap does that. So it's great for your everyday runs or racing. Well, next up we have from Garmin is the all-anticipated 4Runner 110. This is similar to the 310 XT and the 405. It's just a stripped down version, giving you just that GPS capability. Uh, it has a speed and distance monitor along with your pace, your calorie, and also it has a heart rate and non-heart rate monitor capabilities with the 4Runner 110. This is an excellent feature for the runner, especially if you want to break the bank, you have a Gar Garmin 4Runner 110. Well, New to Running Warehouse that we're really excited about coming back in are the sunglasses. And we chose a company, Tyfosi. And for many of you who are unfamiliar with Tyfosi, they're a U.S. based company that originated in 2002. They are striving to provide technologically advanced eyewear for the sports enthusiasts or outdoor activities. And they pride themselves on having uh, that durability uh, and being number one with shattered proof lenses flexible frames, um, value for the customer, so you're really getting a lot of bang for your buck. They offer multiple lenses and colors, so that's really cool, especially with the different climates. It's really nice. Well, I'm going to show you definitely a few frames here. The first ones we have are the Envy, and also too with any of these frames, or you can also use them for the everyday running, racing, uh, even just even that stylish wear. Uh, here is we have the Rubo. And moving on, we have the pave, and we have the slip, and we have a tyrant, and last, we have the Vogel. And as you can see here with the Vogel, these are a little more for that 
everyday kind of fashionable wear. A couple ladies in the office have bought these. They kind of um, ride around in them. Uh, it's pretty cool. Well, for more info on these items, please take a look at the product pages. I'm Trevor the Running Warehouse. We'll see you next time.